This, this is the elephant. <laughs> Good morning guys! Remember in my last video when I was like I might vlog this really exciting thing? Today is that really exciting thing! So this weekend is my boyfriend's birthday. We are doing an overnight stay at London Zoo. It's gonna be ridiculous. I won't say too much now because I don't know that much um, and I think it'll just be more exciting to see what happens as it goes. So I need to get going. It is 7.51 currently. I wanted to leave before 8 <laughs> so that kind of happened. I don't know how much I'm gonna vlog. We'll see, but I've started it at least. So um, yeah, let's go. What did you just say about that snail? It's kind of cute. It's not cute. It is. <laughs> He's totally showing off right now. Wavy and gross. Wavy. <laughs> I'm really excited because they had loads of gluten free stuff at London Zoo. And that is so cute. Tiger McCree. <laughs> Hello, it's <laughs> Oh my god, they're kind of scary. I love such big feet. Imagine that coming towards you. Oh, oh my god. That's you. So apparently at London Zoo, you can only buy canned water. And I thought it was stupid, but now I've bought one, I'm kind of excited. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited. How is it? Is it just water in a can? Can confirm it is just water in a can. <laughs> can confirm. <laughs> How's it going? Very tired. <laughs> I've had a very awesome day. We've been in this room for five minutes and Ollie died. I'm very early coach. I mean that's very true. I'm not surprised I wouldn't have sat next to you. So we've checked in at the wait, what is this called? Uh the Gur Lodge. Gur Lion Lodge. We gave us little towel elephants. Mm -hmm. And this is outside. And we've got a table and chairs. Mm -hmm. Which I think we should go and sit in, in a minute. Yes, definitely. The best part of the day so far was well, my favourite part of the day was these sloths that were like, how far away from us were they? Inches. They were really close. I could have touched them, but we weren't allowed. What is your favourite part then? That's really difficult, actually. Um, I wasn't expecting to love the butterfly bit as much as I did. That was really cool. The sloths were really good. Seeing all those bats was awesome. I liked stroking the goats as well. The goats are good. Stuff. And we saw they're not um, anteaters, but they're like anteaters. Oh, those were cute. There were three and there was a baby one and they were weighing them and that was really cool. We've got a couple of hours now to just do nothing because we've been walking a very long time. Mm -hmm. And then dinner and a tour and lots of wine. For me. Do I know about you? <laughs> beer for me, please. Beer. Do I have to buy you beer because it's your birthday? Is that how it works? Damn it. Obviously it stopped as soon as I got my camera. 
but we should definitely just hear a lion, right? Definitely. I'm pretty sure that was a lion roar. It's really exciting. Really I'm fun. just going to keep my camera on me now because <laughs> that was bad timing. Your arm's going to get tired. I'm not going to do this all day. <laughs> I'm just going to keep the next to me. <laughs> Stopped again. Come on. I swear I'm not lying. <laughs> I'm not going to catch it at any point. This is like when I went to Universal and in um, Diagon oh, Alley the dragon breathed fire and we stood there for so long and then the one time that it did happen was when we were in a shop and everyone ran out of the shop being like oh my god the and but it was already done. That's what this is going to be like. It's nearly six o'clock which is when we go and get our work Prosecco or soft drink. I'm obviously having a Prosecco and then we get a tour until dinner time. This, this is the elephant <laughs> and um, uh, yeah it's a really long tour people are moving no it was just a man seeing what was going on it's really quiet there. There's a really, I think the zoo must be shut yeah, must, exactly must be nice. shut now so we have a tour till like half seven and then we have dinner and then the tour carries on at nine I'm excited I don't know what we're gonna like see what's gonna be different we've already done the whole zoo so it yeah, <laughs> it'd be different well. yeah hopefully tomorrow we'll just see all the things that we really like the most yeah I, aka the not anteaters but the whatever they were I want to see the sloths that's long. I guess it's your birthday so we can do what you want but I want to see the sloths <laughs> might if you think they think you still got food um, they might lean over and try and get it out of your hands so you always want to be careful um, but these guys in China and Mongolia are really cool and um, so people domesticated them for a reason uh, usually for hauling stuff um, but also uh, they're quite useful because you can burn their poo it is so <laughs> it is so um, I don't think that's the main reason they domesticated them <laughs> but um it's, it's so dry, they're so good at keeping the moisture in their bodies that their poo is so dry that you can um, burn it. I don't know how it would smell, so I wouldn't recommend doing it, but you can. chicken and there's yeah. like some feta cheese uh, and loads of broccoli, carrots and potatoes. There's so much there though, it's crazy. It's a mine which they cooked really nicely for my dietary requirements. And the beef bun. Really nice example uh, of how we organise some of it. So we try very hard not to give our animals the same enrichment over and over again. for the tigers <clears throat> and there's a tiger called JJ and he loves ginger <laughs> so this is for JJ <laughs> It felt like we shouldn't be there. Yeah. And we've got like, it's like two hours or tomorrow, right? Or less than Um, that. Yeah, it's about two hours. Like that. That's still a waste of time. I think we're going to go to bed because we have to be up very early. Things are ringing me. You're welcome. Happy beautiful. birthday. Thank you. Okay. Good night. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. It's definitely too early. I wish you were still asleep. <laughs> How do you feel? I'm fine. Well, I, do, just... I do feel a little bit bad because... Um... We killed the elephants. We killed both. 
I mean, at least I took mine head not, apart. You've just got a sad elephant head. We have to go and meet everyone in like 10 minutes for breakfast. And then we have a tour where we get to, oh, we get to see the tigers with the boxes. Yes, and I don't know where else. I wish we were staying more than one night. Mm. It is lovely. Right. And super like, um, considering all the animal noises, super relaxing. I heard lions in the night. Point out whilst they're doing it, they are exhibiting what is known as a finch response. So you might know the Darwin's finch is one of like the famous birds down the Galapagos Islands. They effectively will pick off all like the bacteria and food that's on the shells, and the, the shells and the backs and the legs of the tortoises. But because there's no bird in the UK that can do that, the keepers have to do it. A lot of the time, the lions are out there or there. So everyone's facing the other way, and he gets a bit agitated and bang on the glass. So why are you looking at that? crowd. He does. We're loud, apparently. <laughs> we have left London Zoo, which I'm really sad about. Are you sad? I am sad. But now we're in Camden, and I got kombucha, which I'm super excited about. You got some weird. Yeah, the, like the green tea was in this bit. You had to twist it, and it came out, and it went in the water. That's really cool. And yeah, I like it. I mean, it's like it wakes you up because it's really like, whoa, that's a lot of green tea. <laughs> that was the exact noise you made when you first drank it. Yeah. We are on this burger, and I'm so excited for this burger. But then also, it's not going to fit in my mouth. <laughs> so I'm very excited and scared. I'm scared. <laughs> and mine, mine's easier to eat. I want to eat it. All right, guys. I look like shit. Like, look how sunburnt my nose is. That uh, I can't be trusted to leave the house. In the last two months, the two days I've spent mostly outside, I've got completely sunburnt. So, I think that means no more leaving the house for a while. <laughs> I've completely forgot to vlog most things today, but the wrestling was amazing. And then I vlogged a little bit of Honest Burger where we went for dinner. It's been an amazing weekend, and I know I'm going to be way too tired to finish this when I get home. So I'm going to finish it now. I hope you enjoyed this because like. I just did so much cool stuff this weekend that I literally thought I would never do anything like that. I'm really excited to watch all the footage back and like remember everything because I think I've forgotten things because there was so much. So I'm going to drive home now and I will see you guys next time. Bye!